Hey guys and welcome back to Battlefront Updates and another episode of Star Wars Battlefront 2 Top 5 Plays. First of all, we're in a new month now, a new year actually, which means a brand new HD 60S giveaway together with Elgato Gaming. So if you're interested in bagging yourself a $150 capture card, uh, make sure to just follow that link at the top of the description, it will, it will only take you a few seconds. Same goes if you want to submit a clip, link is also in the description below. But now, let's get into it. Starting up at the number 5 spot, we have Smirken showing off uh, the power of the new KFX Spy uh, with the Rapid Fire, as it's able to deal a significant amount of damage in a very short amount of time here, as he's able to melt both Dooku and Vader with just a couple of well-placed shots. I think it might be some of the highest damage output uh, you can have, although it's in a very short amount of time, but if you land him correctly, well, you're gonna take out your enemies very, very fast. At the number 4 spot we have Paul John showing the power of the new Jet Trooper here in a 1 vs 1 uh, against Ray. who gets completely tricked around uh, by Paul John here. Showing that the new movability of the Jet Trooper can be extremely helpful when dealing with something like a lightsaber wheeler. So uh, very well played there Paul John. At the number 3 spot we have Sage with a really good multi-kill here on Camino with Grievous who is kind of the master of multi-kills in terms of the heroes. Uh, at least in my opinion. Combining the unrelenting advance, claw rush, thrust search and some good and some good old lightsaber hits to give him like 15 kills I think in a couple of seconds so he almost wipes out the entire enemy team here and clears the way for his teammates to go in there and capture that point. At the number 2 spot we have Blaruga back here on the show with a uh, quiet nice snipe as he actually takes a great speeder jumps up in the air, dismounts and then mid-air snipes this guy with a no-scope. Which is a kind of trick shot I have never seen before in Battlefront 2, as there's usually not any height you can jump off, but in this case, use the crate speeder, jump up and pull off something like this, uh, very nice by Baruga. At the number one spot of Alfie BF2, showing the power of the Evisian Gunner here on the last phase of crate as he absolutely obliterates the enemy team here with obviously the main blaster most of all but also with some nice smacks well really showing how powerful the Ovisian gunner can be and although I am a huge fan of the Sith Trooper and it fits my playstyle more I would have to say that the Ovisian gunner is probably the most powerful out of the uh, four new reinforcements um, and this clip it kind of shows that it can make even more difference than a hero in the right position so well played on that Alfie BF2 but that brings this video to and as always a big thank you to Elgato Gaming for sponsoring this series. If you're interested in any of their capture cards, green screens or other products you can find a link to that in the description below. Thank you very much for watching and as always may the force be with you.